last day we've had here at the Cozy Confidence shoot, um, supported by Sequins and Sand. I'm Anita from Sequins and Sand, and this is part of the crew here today. These beautiful women have joined us from all sorts of places, really, and different journeys to get here today. So I thought it might be nice just to have a chat to them about how they feel about being in a cosy now, um, what cosy confidence means to them, but also how we have helped make them feel confident in their swimsuit. Uh, from my point of view, I am called the cosy whisperer because, <laughs> because I have this magical ability to be able to find the right cosy for the right woman and particularly for her shape. Um, I think it's really important that women understand it's not about their size. It is about shape more than size. And even then, it's only a guide. It's something that will lift your spirits when you find the right shape of Cozy to work with your shape, then that's the extra magic that happens. And that's the process we've been through to get to this point today. The girls um, and some of them over the years know which shapes work for them now from a swimsuit point of view. Um, but they've each um, had an open mind, which is the other really important thing and because they've had an open mind, open to different styles that really work for them. So we're all in different things today. Some of us have different shapes, but we're in the same cozies, and that's because some cuts are really, really versatile, like this zip up. Um, but we each have an individual shape and that should be celebrated as we are all beautiful and we all should enjoy <laughs> our summers with great freedom and joy. So we're just gonna have a chat now in the round about what cosy confidence means to each of us. And I'm gonna start in any particular order. I'm gonna start with Alison. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Starting with the A. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I get that a lot too. Yeah. <laughs> what does cosy confidence mean to you? Well, it's it's been life changing actually, I have to admit. I I used to hide away in my costumes, I used to hide away in photos, I'd stand behind my husband, I wouldn't be in photos, I wouldn't go to the beach without covering up, um, and I would jump into the water at the last minute and then cover up again when I came out, and now I have my own pool and I walk around in my togs in my backyard, and my backyard is open to a uh, park lens and everybody's walking past and I don't care. <laughs> and the same with when I'm at the beach now, I just stride along, I've got four lovely grandsons and I'm, I've been shown um, the way, uh, if you like, and I'm now happy to um, jump on the sand with my, my grandsons and play with mm. them and, uh, and I feel comfortable and confident in my, in my swimsuit now and I'm not worried. So it's changed how you live your summer. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Making those memories is really important, isn't yeah. it? P particularly, and it's quite interesting. I've had lots of conversations over the years with different women, and um, it's amazing how women didn't do it with their own children, but now they're making an extra special effort to do it with the grandchildren. And that's a whole other generation. And in some ways that makes me quite sad to think it took that long to get to that point but I'm so happy that they are there and that they're able to do it and celebrate it. Do you find that, Marg, or you've just always dived into life because you're that kind of woman? I'm probably, a, yeah, a little bit more outgoing, but I must say internally, yeah. I probably feel so much better, especially since the first time Rachel gave me a voucher to um, Anita's Sequins and Sands shop at Ashgrove for a birthday and that started me on the journey because immediately I felt a rapport with you and to be able to put on things and straight away you knew it either felt good or didn't yeah. and Anita could find the thing that suited you best and yeah it's been great yeah, yeah, we did have really a happy oh, yeah love you mark you're, yeah you're and look at you today in your brights oh, you're out there love so yes enjoying. i've been black until now yeah, or black and white but yeah <laughs> today i'm today i'm really getting brave yes. <laughs> it looks beautiful yeah. it looks beautiful so rachel you brought mum in so I maybe think, it's your turn to have yeah, a bit of a chat I there's a nice segue the yeah. <laughs> well i think for me um I don't think I missed out on too much. However, I'm not as awkward as I used to be, right. I would say. <laughs> and so I guess what brought me initially to um, Sequins in Sand was my bust and yeah. looking for swimwear that was for the 
the larger busted lady, yes. I guess. Yeah. And um, and I actually don't know exactly how I found you, Anita, but I God, I'm so glad I did. <laughs> and um, so before Mum, obviously I road tested Anita, <laughs> and um, and I think it, it is really true what you say. I think um, you know, we've all been blessed with a unique body, mm. and um. You know we're all never satisfied so i think you know i've just decided just to own what i've got and just you know yeah. live it and um and also you know i'm a role model i'm a i'm a mom i'm a an aunt i'm a you know whatever and i think it's really important to um to instill that um the cosy confidence values Journey. into um our next generations mm -hmm. and you know even into mum, you know, older generations, um, all generations. But yeah, I think when you are wearing something that you know works for you, it does elevate you. Yeah. And yeah, um, yeah and so I've had some wonderful experiences, you know, with Seekins and Sand and I've been on the retreat and I've, um, you know, we're here today and mum and I are here thanks to COVID because some of the other beautiful babes couldn't be here. So <laughs> mum and I are rocking in, um, you know, yes. and some of you are really sad maybe that, you know, you're not here and, and yes, it would have been lovely, but it's been really nice for mum and I to have a, a reason to um, to join in and it's just been beautiful just being around other women that are, um, you know, to share this and that are really, uh, mm -hmm. that really value um, what Cosy Confidence is. And so I think for me, it's just owning, owning what I am and just living it, sharing it, breathing it and yeah, that's rocking awesome. it now, not that's being awesome. awkward about it. Yeah, yeah. that's beautiful. Thank you, Rachel. Um, how about you, Sue? Oh. No! <laughs> you thought I was going to go to Tammy, didn't you? Ah-ha! <laughs> um, oh, where, would, where do we go? You've said it. Yeah, said you've it. said it all. Well, how, yeah. did you find Anita? Anita? how did you find Anita? Oh, I've already talked about yeah. that. Yeah. But, but I will say, because I've just moved to the Gold Coast again, like we used to live here, but I was so busy back then with children, now I'm seeing more mm. and you just on every shop front it seems on the side of buses on the side of the the like trams I don't know what they call them there's Brazilian butt lifts and yeah. go to mm. this plastic surgeon and yeah. that plastic surgeon mm. and mm. and Botox. then I, I saw a thing where people were showing they couldn't afford to have the Brazilian butt lifts so they could make these little pads and stick them in there. And I thought, how sad, you know? Yeah. Teach people to love themselves, teach teach the young ones, because the little kids yeah. are seeing all that. Yeah. 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 Teach them how there's such great variety in us. Not one of us is the same, unless you're yeah. an identical twin. And even they're a little bit different. Yeah, they? yeah, that's yeah. true. Like yeah. embrace the, the variety. Embrace and, the difference and the unique. And then you show each and every one of them how to find the perfect quiz swimming costume and yeah yeah I think that if we're all more aware and you're helping the awareness mm. awareness is everything and you girls all play a part in that right you yeah, know it, this everyone. wouldn't happen if you weren't here so thank you for everything that you're doing to help the cause because it mm. yeah the more get behind it the more who see it we're yeah, all ambassadors. Ambassadors. that's right <laughs> that's right Tammy you've got a bit of a slightly different story maybe what's yours yeah i got roped in from a, a work angle um i was like i'll just go do this retreat and um so i did the shine retreat with anita and um and that was just transformative for so many women and it was the most beautiful um thing to watch you know people emerge at the end of of that weekend it was really special um, and at the end of that, Anita threw a pair of togs on me <laughs> and I was just like, oh my gosh, you really are the cosy whisperer because I felt really confident and that from that moment, because I think it's two things. I think it's being confident, but also having the right fitting swimsuit and feeling good in it. Mm -hmm. So because yeah. I had that then, um, what sticks out in my mind is the memories that I've made since then. Mm -hmm. So um, I distinctly remember um, a really hot day at a family do, and I jumped in the pool with all the nieces and nephews, and they were like, oh, wow, Aunty Tam never comes for a swim. <laughs> like, I was just... I'm doing this and let's go and we so you know yeah. just the memories that can be made by just putting that stuff to one side and um 
and just focusing on yeah there is more to me than just what I look like yeah. and those kids adored the fact that I jumped in the pool and they will remember so, that all yeah, of their lives yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. so good so yeah <laughs> yeah that's fantastic thank you thanks everybody again for being here and um thanks for yeah. the invitation yeah Lisa. thank you yeah. for the opportunity yeah, yeah. We'll do it again next year and everyone's invited again. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks so much. Bye.